Welcome to this Windows Computer and Technology channel. And um, one of the things that I get quite regularly is about people uh, asking me about problems that they have when their computer goes to sleep mode. This has always been an area where Windows often has problems in waking up the hardware when you go in sleep mode. That's why Personally, in most of my machines, I disable sleep uh, unless I'm on a laptop with battery. Then, of course, you don't want to drain your battery, so sleep is um, a good idea. But for the rest, there are computers that you have to live with the fact that they are not going to wake up well. Unfortunately, there are machines like that. There are machines that it works great. And there's the machines that it can work great, but you have to do some extra steps uh, in which, it, for example, updating drivers is going to be helpful. What happens in Windows when you go to sleep mode, and you can see your sleep settings, by the way, by going into settings in Windows 10. And in the settings, you will go into system, and you will, of course, look at power in sleep. And here, you have the screen that can go dark, which is something that you can do if you want. To. Um, and that does save a lot of battery, by the way, if you're on the laptop on battery. So you can actually give it a uh, time where the screen will actually shut down um, for saving energy. But there's also what we call sleep. And sleep is a very different thing. Without shutting down your PC, sleep actually will shut down and remove power for a lot of the hardware that your computer has. It typically will keep the minimum amount of power needed just to refresh the RAM memory, for example, in some cases, and to just be in a state that it's ready to actually start up because Windows is still there, it's still loaded in memory, but shutting down as much of the hardware as possible to save energy. Now, that is something, like I said, that could be problematic for some. One of the best ways, if your computer goes to sleep mode and it just doesn't wake up well, um, the best thing to do first would be to check for updates on the drivers. Um, one of the most important things in Windows when you wake up from sleep is how the drivers can actually work with the hardware to power them back on and make sure that the connectivity comes back on on you know your Wi-Fi and whatever other device and drivers have a big big job to do in here and of course drivers that's the first thing you'll focus on if you have problems updating drivers means going to the manufacturer of your computer checking drivers for every device that you have, um, you know, sound, graphics, um, Wi-Fi, Ethernet, whatever is needed for your computer to work. Often, updating the drivers to the latest versions fixes the problem. Now, in a other uh, way of thinking, if your computer goes to sleep well and you see that there's a driver update, it sometimes can actually break sleep, unfortunately. So if you do have driver updates, if your computer's going, you know, works well and that driver is not something you really need, you might just want to leave it alone and, and not update the driver if sleep mode works well. So that's another thing to think about. For some machines, like I said, the hardware itself might be a problem. It could be the motherboards, the way that the motherboard communicates with all the different parts. That is a problem. BIOS is also something that might actually interfere with a good sleep mode. So uh, updating the BIOS of the computer could be a good idea. But there are machines where it never works well. And that there's nothing you can do about it. Um, the only way you can actually have it fine is then to do like I do. I, I never let my computers, most of my computers, go to sleep in general. Uh, my gaming laptop does on battery, but 
when it's not on battery, I do not let it go to sleep, honestly. Although mine seems to work well in coming back from sleep. So what you could do is go into the power settings here and in sleep, just choose never rather than uh, let it go to sleep if you have issues. So updating drivers, updating the BIOS, two things you can try to make sure that, you know, your sleep comes back well. Uh, just make sure also that you don't install unnecessary software that could interfere with sleep mode also. And if all fails and it doesn't work well, you might need to disable sleep mode. And, you know, just shut down your PC when you don't use it and uh, start it up again when needed. Um, but I know that sleep mode is useful because it's much faster than having a PC boot up. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching our videos.